when it comes to Quidditch, we've all wondered, do I have what it takes to be the next Quidditch star? To beat my toughest opponents? To keep my composure when it matters most? To chase my dreams at any price? To seek glory for my team? Because someday, that dream could become a reality. And the road won't always be easy. But if you just keep getting back on your broom... ...and trust in your teammates... ...Quidditch... ...is magic. So ask yourself again... ...do you have what it takes? Do you have the heart of a Quidditch champion?
every Quidditch champion's journey has to start somewhere. And for many, that's in our own backyard. In our minds, the garden is a grand Quidditch pitch, and wind blowing in the trees is a roaring crowd. Can you picture yourself playing among your heroes? Welcome to our backyard Quidditch pitch. Before you take flight, let's make sure you're comfortable on your broom. Rest comfortably in the saddle and double check your grip position. When you think up, the broom should do exactly what you want. If flying doesn't feel natural, try some adjustments. There are a lot of threats on the Quidditch field. Mastering your evasive flying will keep you out of harm's way. You can really push your broom for an extra boost of speed, but it won't last forever. You'll eventually need to ease off and recover. I think you're ready for something a little more advanced. Drifting will let you fly in one direction while looking in another. Not bad. Looks like you're getting the hang of it. Definitely better than Neville's first time on a broom from what I heard. Here's a quick challenge to really see what you can do. There's no rush to move on until you're comfortable. Brilliant. Then let's brush up on Quidditch, shall we? It's really not all that complicated once you know all the positions. Each team has three chasers. They're the heart of the Quidditch team, if I do say so myself. That ball is called the Quaffle, and the chaser's job is to, well, chase it. When the other team has the Quaffle, our chasers need to get it back at all costs and bring it towards the opponent's goal. And working as one, Throwing the quaffles through any opposing goal scores our team points and brings us that much closer to victory. Quidditch is fast-paced and you'll often need to change your approach quickly. Sometimes a change in perspective is all you need. As a chaser, your main concern is the quaffle. Have a look for it now. Quidditch is first and foremost a team game. When you find yourself in an advantageous position, let your team know by calling for a pass. Now that you've got the quaffle, don't forget about the rest of your team. Individual talent will only get you so far. The truly great chasers know they need to pass to their teammates. As a chaser, your main focus is to score points for your team. The more you score, the closer you get to winning. Get those points by throwing the... Always be on the hunt for the quaffle. If an opposing chaser has possession, that can easily be resolved with a swift tackle. Impressive work so far. You've proven you can score on an empty goal, but they won't always be undefended. Let's see if you can slip one past a keeper. That about does it for the chasers. Are you feeling ready for a warm-up match? I was hoping you would say that. Let's go chasers only for this first match.
This is the Weasley Twins, excited to show off our moves. This is Ginny Weasley, co-commentator for this match. Let the fun begin. No one's hogging the quaffle on this team. The chase surpasses. Lines up. What a shot! Great work, Chaser. That's the end of the match. Perfect timing, too. I think the gnomes are back again. This match has been brought to you by the handsome blokes at the Weasley Burrow. Mind you, don't step on any gnomes on your way out. I honestly didn't think we'd win the very first match, but it was well earned. Shall we challenge them to a rematch? Or are you ready to learn more about Quidditch? All right, the lesson continues. The Keeper adds a lot of depth to the game, so let's add one now. Oh, and I think my brother Ron will be the best person to fly you through this role. Have fun! <laughs> Quidditch would be rubbish without the keeper guarding the goals. A good defence can make all the difference in a match. Your team's keeper has one very important job. Stop that quaffle from going through any of your goals. Being a good keeper requires the tactical mind to predict where the quaffle will be shot and the agility to stop it. With their vantage point, a keen keeper inspire and guide their chasers as well. It may sound like a lot of responsibility, but nothing beats the feeling of single-handedly saving a goal. Chasers can play a decent defense, but to properly guard the goals requires that keepers have their own way of moving. More like a hummingbird than a hippogriff. 
Give it a try. Diving is an important skill for a keep to learn. It lets you move quickly and accurately between the goal rings. As a keeper, it's important to know where the quaffle is at all times. Don't forget to keep focus on it when you need to. The keeper's job is simple in theory. Stop the other team from scoring goals. It's trickier in practice. Chasers will try and trick you, so keep a close eye on them and be ready to move. Your team depends on you thinking on your feet. Um, broomstick in this case. Oi! Don't doze off back there. You've still got a team to help. From here, you've got the best view of the happenings on the field. Show us your leadership skills and give your team some guidance. Now let's take a look at your play calling from the chaser's point of view. Flying through auras will give you a speed and energy boost. The Keeper's Kick is an indispensable tool. You can use it to deflect quaffles and bludgers, or you can even give other players a good whack to drive them away. Let's give it a go. Try and save this next shot on goal by deflecting it with a big kick. That's about all you need to know as a Keeper. Are you ready to play a match with proper... Brilliant. With the keepers added to the game, things are about to get a lot more interesting. This is the Weasley, Weasley Twins. Twins. Excited to... We were supposed to do chores today instead of going off to play Quidditch. But no one said anything about bringing the Quidditch to us. Here comes the bludgers! Moving it downfield. He spots her chance. And she scores! Great pass. Stole the bottle. There's a pass. She launched. She scores. That's the end of the match. Perfect timing, too. I think the gnomes are back again. This is Ginny Weasley, signing off. That was a great match. Offense and defense are both crucial on the Quidditch pitch. Now, shall we move to the next level? Brilliant. Let's move on to the roles that make Quidditch truly unique. Starting with the beater. Better find someone fearless for the job. I know Fred has been giddy to go over this bit. Or was that George?
Ah, beaters. You either love them or hate them, depending on which side of the bludger you're on. What are bludgers? They're iron balls that are fast, aggressive, and enchanted to knock players off their brooms. A beater's job is to use a bat to drive those nasty buggers away from your team. Or theirs. What could be better than seeing your opponent set up a perfect play and totally ruining their plans? Chaser isn't equipped to deal with bludgers. For that, you'll need the beater's best friends. A bat as a beater, your main focus should be on supporting your teammates by disrupting your opponents. And that all starts with a bludger. Drifting isn't just a chaser trick. Beaters can do the same, often the devastating effect. Quidditch is an incredibly physical game. Every hit will knock you off balance. Take too many hits, and you'll be tumbling off your broom. When all else fails, you can just pretend you are the bludger and tackle your opponents. That usually doesn't work. Let's put all this practice into play. Hit that player with a well-placed bludgeon. Don't worry about hurting them. They volunteered for this. Well, they were voluntold to do this, but I'm sure they'll be fine. Okay, let's knock them off their broom. Same as last time. Send a bludger their way while they're still off balance. Maybe we should worry about hurting them. Just spectacular. Fred and George would be proud. Now take what you've learned and master it. Knock everyone on the field off their broom. Now that you understand what a beater does, are you ready to see them in action? Then let's play a match with bludgers and beaters in the mix. Watch your head out there. Let's hope this match turns out better than the last time we played Quidditch. Speak for yourself, I had a great time. But then again, I am the better athlete. The quaffle's up! Chaser is not afraid of close contact. She takes go. Loose. She lines up the shot. The keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat. The visitors steal possession. End of the match. Perfect timing too. I think the gnomes are back again. Now that's done. Let's see if we can get a word from our winners.
Phew, nothing like dodging blood just to get your adrenaline going. How did you fare? No broken bones or brooms, right? Should we play another match before? Then that means we're ready to learn the last piece of the Quidditch puzzle. The Seekers and the Golden Snitch. I'm not a bad Seeker myself, but I wasn't the youngest Seeker in a century. So, I'll let Harry handle this one. Everybody knows the Seeker. Their job is to find and catch the elusive Golden Snitch to score big for their team. Easier said than done, as it's the size of a walnut. I suppose they don't call it seeking for nothing. But aside from sharp eyes, you better have sharp reflexes too. Because once you find the Snitch, you'll also need to chase it and grab it before the opposing Seeker does. If you can stay close to the Snitch, anticipate its movements, and dodge a bludger or two, you can actually hold victory in your hands. Seekers are entirely focused on the Golden Snitch, an elusive golden ball. It's tricky to find and even harder to catch, but gives your team a load of points. When the Snitch has been detected... Usually, you'd need to find the Snitch first, but for now, we'll just focus on the fundamentals. You'll get a chance to play hide-and-seek with it later. The Snitch is famously hard to keep an eye on. Stay focused to avoid losing track of it. Keeping up with the Snitch can be difficult, but using those gold rings will let you fly faster for longer. Seekers need to be quick and agile, making tight turns at a moment's notice. This time, you'll need to find the Snitch yourself, and quickly too. You won't be the only one looking for it when we're actually playing. Keep your eyes open for a glint of gold and listen out for the flitter of its wings. With that, you know everything you need to know to play Quidditch properly. Are you ready for your first real match? Okay, this one is for all the gobstones. We'll be playing with full teams now, so let's not hold back. This is the Weasley Twins, your favorite pranksters. 
and quit. Welcome back to the pitch. Get comfortable, but don't forget to duck. Let the fun begin. She shoots. She shoots. She scores. Pass. There's the shot. Go! She takes the shot. She this chaser is unstoppable. Chaser lines up the shot and... Great teamwork, great keeper, great save! She takes the purple sword through the post! Whoa! Watch out for that beater! Up to the snitch. She takes a fist chase to make scoring goals look easy. A few white team steals possession. That's a pass to a teammate. She lines up the shot. Nice save. Always good to see a team passing the quaffle around. What a great pass! The game is halfway over, and anything can happen still. There goes the and the quaffle is in. The beater made short work of that player. the shot. The keeper stops the quaffle. That snitch is so close to being caught. And that's a goal. Team saves it. She stole the quaffle. The bat 
battle for the snitch is over, but the war continues on. Her eyes lock on her teammate, and she makes a pass. But the visitors steal possession. I can hear the snitch, but where is it? She, she found, found the snitch. snitch. What a great pass. Passing the portal around. <laughs> Nothing's getting past these goalposts. Wonder what was more painful for Hermione. That hit, or almost going head dip. She goes. The seeker is catching up to the snitch. It's just so close to being caught. She spots her chance to score. The Weasley team saves it. That's a pass to a teammate. The snitch has been caught. Yeah, the salamander we lost in the house, on the other hand. No time to slack off. There's just 30 seconds left. Pressure is on as the chaser makes the shot. The beats are not to play it down. With this, well done, chaser. Ten points. Snitches revealed. <laughs> this was fun, but we have to run. Time is galleons after all. Now that was Quidditch. The speed, the teamwork, the danger. It's all so thrilling. A resounding victory. I don't think any of them saw that coming. You've really earned our illustrious Garden Cup. We found some spare brooms lying around if you wanted them. Gave them a quick dusting and everything. They may not look like much right now, but given some time, I'm sure you'll be able to unlock their true potential. At Hogwarts, there are few greater ways to bring honor to your house than playing on the Quidditch team. Against the likes of Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin. Could you win the Hogwarts House Quidditch Cup? We'll beat you to that cup, Slytherin, and we'll play fair doing it. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Today, Gryffindor and Slytherin face off in a battle of courage, 
versus cunning. What tricks, sorry, tactics, do Slytherin have up their sleeve? We'll have to wait and see. The pace of passes. There's the gun, it's in! took a real bludgeoning. What a shot! The Seeker is catching up to the Snitch! The Chaser passes! Possession. 
Yeah. And, and it soars through the goal! Lee Jordan, and please vote for me as the Daily Prophet's most engaging Quidditch announcer. Slytherin, you might have the lead now, but Ravenclaw has enough heart to turn this cup around. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Slytherin go into today's game looking to widen their lead over Ravenclaw. But if anyone can mount a comeback, it's the creative Ravenclaws. Madam Hoot releases the quaffle, and the game begins! There's the shot! <laughs> nice save! Ravenclaw still possession! There goes the shot! The keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat! Takes the shot! That's a knockout by the beater! <laughs> Lither in still possession! There goes the shot! The keeper stops the quaffle! The chaser passes. Slytherin still possession! There's the shot! What a save! Nothing's getting past that keeper! Slytherin takes the shot! Nice save! The chaser passes. Slytherin still possession! Yes, keep it moving down. The snitch is revealed! Ravenclaw takes the shot! Slither 
and saves it. That's a pass to a teammate. There goes the shot. Ravenclaw saves it. The quaffle is passed. Slytherin takes the shot. The seeker is halfway to catch the snitch. Slytherin still possession. Ravenclaw still possession. That snitch is on its last legs. Uh, <laughs> wings. Slytherin still possession! The Quaffle is not to lose! There's the shot! Oh, oh, the Keeper stops the Quaffle! The player takes a nasty tumble. And there's a Quaffle pass. A moment, is that? Oh, it is! The Seekers caught the snitch! Slytherin's 
ambition earns them a win over Ravenclaw. You've been a wonderful crowd. I'm your go-to Quidditch expert, and I'll be here all week. Underdogs we may be, but underestimate our resolve at your own peril, Slytherin. We're here to reclaim our rightful place. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. This time, Hufflepuff attempts to shake off a losing record against a Slytherin team that's dogged them all season. Will the persistence finally pay off? The chasers race for the quaffle. Who will gain possession first? Waffle is past. Waffle pass still possession. Slytherin still possession. Yes, keep it moving downfield. Chase the passes.
over. And it's in! That's the player down! Slytherin still possession! There's the shot! But the shot's no good! Hufflepuff takes the shot, and it goes wide of the hoop. Passes the quaffle. The quaffle is passed. Slytherin takes the shot. Who will be the first to find the slit? There goes the shot! But the shot goes wide! It's the snitch! But who'll be the first to catch it? There's the sh the chaser scores a goal! Slytherin snatches the win today! Congratulations again to today's big winner, me, Lee Jordan, for scoring a date! You know who you are. Underdogs we may be, but underestimate our resolve at your own peril, Slytherin. We're here to reclaim. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Slytherin mount their brooms smugly, confident they'll extend their winning record against Hufflepuff today. But you know what the pros say, pride comes before a nine meter fall. The bludgers are loose. Everyone watch your heads. And it's in! And the chaser tie the game! Ending hit for that poor chaser. Slytherin still possession. There's the shot, and the quaffle is in. Slytherin still 
possession! Passes the quaffle. There goes the shot! Slytherin saves it! She passes the quaffle. That's a pass to a teammate. On the prize seekers. Slytherin still possession. Slytherin, what a shot! above all, but that was fun to watch. The Seeker is catching up to the snitch! That's the fumble! The Quaffle is passed! The Chaser fumble! Waffle pass. Slytherin still possession. Waffle pass still possession. Slytherin still possession. There's the shot. The chaser scores the goal. There goes the shot, and it goes wide of the hoop. There's a quaffle pass. Hufflepuff takes the shot! What a save! Nothing's getting past that keeper! The Quaffle is passed! Yes! Keep it moving downfield! And the Chaser tie the game! The Keeper stops the Quaffle! Oh, 
Oh, anything can happen in the last minute. Hufflepuff saves it. The Puffle is loose. Slytherin take advantage of Hufflepuff's weaknesses and seize victory. I'm Hogwarts' number one and only Quidditch announcer. Until next time. Season. We step onto the pitch with our heads held high against Slytherin. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Slytherin go into today's game looking to widen their lead over Ravenclaw. But if anyone can mount a comeback, it's the creative Ravenclaws. Madam Hooch releases the quaffle, and the game begins! Run, but you just cannot hide from this seeker. Slytherin takes the shot. She 
Officer Quaffle? has been brought to you by arguably Hogwarts' most passionate Quidditch fan, me! No need to mention any other Gryffindors. Smug Slytherins look like the nasal that got the cream as they show off the Hogwarts House Quidditch Cup trophy. Looks like you'll really gain the hang of Quidditch. It's the same as anything, really. The more you play, the better you'll get, and the more skills you learn. The rivalry between the three greatest wizarding schools in Europe is legendary. But on the Quidditch pitch, which would prevail? The grace of Bobaton's Academy of Magic? The strength of Durmstrang Institute? Or the determination of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry? Salut Hogwarts! Let us show heart in the face of this formidable cup. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Today, Hogwarts takes on Beaubaton. And I ask out a cute French girl. It's a big day all around. The players lurch into action, eager to be the first to score. The Beaubaton and set the goal! Passes the quaffle. Robaton team steal possession. Yes, keep it moving downfield. The Hogwarts team steal possession. Will this turn it soar through the goal? Pop 
beautiful pawn. The beta's target is down for the count. There goes the snitch. There's the snitch, but who'll be the first to catch it? Can the chaser tie the game? But the Seeker secures the catch nonetheless. The Robaton team steal possession. What a great pass. The chaser passes. There goes the shot and takes the score! Had a good run, but you just cannot hide from this seeker. This match has been brought to you by arguably Hogwarts' most passionate Quidditch fan, me. No need to mention any other Gryffindors.
Thank you, Hogwarts. Your excellence and successes have only further motivated us to win today. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Today, Durmstrang attempt to get a win over Hogwarts. Of course, this will be no easy feat. The quaffle is up! The Durmstrang team takes the shot! Nice save! There's a quaffle pass. There's the shot! The keeper stops the quaffle! The Hogwarts team still possession! The Hogwarts to go! emerges with the snitch. Hogwarts face 
has been caught. Aiden Warnock, you can go home now. underestimates us, but we have surprise en réserve for them. I am Tufis Rondobert, and I would like to dedicate this match to my late maman. Without... Oh, oh, oh. Rumor has it that a player on Beaubaton fancies a certain rival chaser. Could that explain Beaubaton's poor record against Hogwarts this tournament? There goes the shot, and the quaffle is in! Teammate, the waffle is not to lose. 
Hogwarts team still possession! Turn of events. The Hogwarts team still possession. Pass it to Quapple. The Hogwarts who won a shot.
The Keeper stops the Quaffle! The Quaffle is passed! That's a pass to a teammate! The Quaffle is loose! The Bobaton team takes the shot! The Keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat! The Chaser passes! There's a Quaffle pass! Alle Seeker! The Seeker reaches for the Golden Snitch and claps it! Merci beaucoup for joining us at Bobaton today! Looking forward to having you again! Do not underestimate us, Hogwarts. Dormstrang may be down now, but we are resilient. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Dormstrang have been keeping mum about trailing Hogwarts in the standings in their post-game interviews. But I bet their beaters will have something to say about it on the pitch today. The players lurch into action, eager to be the first to score.
the Hogwarts team still possession! The Dunstrang team still possession! Wait a moment, is that... Ha! <laughs> it is! The Seekers caught the snitch! Had a good run, but you just cannot hide from this seeker. A round of applause to the winner of today's game, me, your charming announcer for betting on the right team and profiting quite handsomely. Your team is formidable, Hogwarts, but Durmstrang will fight until the end. This is Lee Jordan, your favorite Quidditch commentator. Today, Durmstrang attempt to get a win over Hogwarts. Of course, this will be no easy feat. The keepers assume their positions as the whistle blows. Lost control.
Wolf team still possession. There's the shot. But it misses the mark. Keep it moving downfield. The Hogwarts team still possession. There's a bottle pass. The Hogwarts team takes the shot. It's free! The Hogwarts team still possession! Take the passes. The snitch is revealed! Can a hero save us from this lull and score? No one ever said Quidditch was easy. Let yourself wide open, Hogwarts. The Seeker is catching up to the Snitch! Passes the Quapple. There goes the and that's the goal! The snitch is within reach! Don't lose focus now! Yes! Keep it moving downfield! Halfway there! Who comes out on top? After a fierce struggle, one seeker is left, holding the prize. Ace the passes. Go! There really is no better feeling than putting the quaffle through the post.
The quaffle is past. There goes and it soars through the gold. The stitch has been caught. Hogwarts unsurprisingly defeat Durmstrang, whose minds were on everything but the match. Until next time! There's no greater test of a team's skill than the Quidditch World Cup. Nations from all across the Wizarding World send their very best players to compete for international glory. Could your team stand above the rest and become the ultimate Quidditch champion? Uganda is a fan favorite this year, but Quidditch isn't a popularity contest, is it? Though, if it were, would you agree you're the underdog in this match? Players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. The Quaffle is to chase our scores! United Kingdom takes the shot. That's a player down. There's the shot. The keeper stops the quaffle. Lines up the shot. United Kingdom steals possession. Incredible shot. The beater knocked a player down. Can anyone see where the snitch went? She found the snitch. The wolf and that a goal. United Kingdom steals possession. The seeker is halfway to catch the snitch. Uganda takes the shot, but the shot's no good. The 
snitch is within reach. Don't lose focus now. Goal! That poor keeper never had a chance. United Kingdom steals possession. Oh my! The Seekers caught the snitch. We're halfway into a nail-bitingly tense match. Sheet, and it soars through the goal! United Kingdom steals possession. They go and it's in. The United Kingdom win, living to fight another day. Can their willpower take them all the way to the top of the Quidditch world stage? insist that Mexico demonstrating superior flying and ball handling skills does not make them the clear favorite of the next match. Tell us then, what does? Players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. She the chaser scores! The beater knocks their victim right off the broom. Passes. The portal is passed. She goes for and she makes the shot. The chaser passes. There's a quaffle pass. That's a knockout by the beater. The quaffle and it's in. a pass to a teammate. Mexico takes the shot. She makes the save. The chaser passes. There's the snitch, but who will be the first to catch it? Mexico saves it. That's a pass to a teammate. There's the sh what a shot! The 
Vita knocked her opponent out of the skies. United Kingdom steals possession. The chaser scores a goal. A hit like that is going to leave more than just a mark. Takes the shot. United Kingdom steals possession. Halfway there, who comes out on top? There's the shot. She makes the save. Seeker captures the snitch and the glory. This could break the tie. Mexico saves it. Chaser shoots for the win. United Kingdom saves it. She passes the quaffle. What a close game. The winner is anyone's guess. The quaffle is not loose. She takes the shot. United Kingdom steals possession. It's good for Anderson. Oh, that's a miss. Nice try, Chaser. Oh dear, you hate to see that happen. The snitch is revealed. The quaffle is passed. Waffle is loose. The beater knocked a player down. The seeker is halfway to catch the snitch. The chaser fumbles. Time's ticking, 60 seconds. She goes for the shot. The keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat. Can the chaser tie the game? The Seeker has the snitch! Oh, 30 seconds, but it's not over till it's over. And the Quaffle is in! Waffle pass. The quaffle is shot. She blocks the shot.
would never entertain a rumor. Not even one that the United States has non-regulation charms on their brooms. Care to speculate? The players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. Makes a purse. The beater knocked her opponent at the chaser scores. Ouch. A hit like that is bound to leave more than just physical scars. There's a quaffle pass. Quaffle is shot. She blocks the shot. She shoots. She scores. A hit like that is going to leave more than just a single mark. She goes for the shot. The keeper blocked the goal without breaking a sweat. She the chaser scores. the snitch, but where is it? The beater knocked a player down. The snitch is revealed. She lighted incredible shots. is halfway to catch the snitch. The chaser fumbles. USA steals possession. United Kingdom steals possession. USA steals possession. That's a pass to a teammate. The quaffle is passed. The match has reached the halfway mark. The chaser scores a goal! With eyes set aflame with passion, the seeker reaches out and grabs the snitch. The shot goes! That's a pass to a teammate. You liked an incredible shot!
United Kingdom steals possession. The portal is passed. USA steals possession. There's a portal pass. There's the shot. What a save. Nothing's getting past that keeper. Eyes to the skies, Seekers. The snitch is loose. The Seeker found it, but can she catch it? She lost the quaffle. takes the shot. United Kingdom saves it. USA steals possession. USA takes the shot. She makes the save. That snitch is so close to being caught. And the quaffle is in! The Peter made short work of that player. Ah, the joy of victory and agony of defeat. Would never enter. The players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. She takes she scores. United Kingdom steals possession. Chaser scores. United Kingdom steals possession. And it's in. We have a player down. That's a pass to a teammate. United Kingdom steals possession. The quaffle is shot. What a save. Nothing's getting past that keeper. Waffle is passed. She lines up the shot. The keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat. That's a fumble! The snitch is revealed! She goes, and that's a goal! United Kingdom steals possession! The quaffle is shot! The keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat. The ch 
Chaser passes. That snitch is on its last legs, uh, wings. She passes the quaffle. There's the shot, incredible shot. Seeker has the snitch! She goes for the shot. Nice save! The creature's target is down for the count. She shoots. The keeper stops the quaffle. There's a quaffle pass. There's the shot. United Kingdom saves it. And she scores! United Kingdom steals possession! USA steals possession. There's a quaffle path. United Kingdom steals possession. Her eyes lock onto the snitch. But USA intercepts it. She's passing the quaffle. Like and that's a goal! That's a knockout by the beta. want to know if you're aware of how many players Germany's beta has knocked unconscious this year. The players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. There's a waffle pass. She what a shot! She and that's a goal. is not loose. The portal is passed. The beaker knocked the player down.
Chaser passes. There's a quaffle pass. United Kingdom steals possession. There's the and the quaffle is in. That's a player down. United Kingdom steals possession. Breaking news, the chaser scored. There's the snitch, but who will be the first to catch it? There's a quaffle pass. Waffle is loose. She lines up the shot. Germany saves it. The quaffle is passed. That's a pass to a teammate. The seeker is halfway to catch the snitch. Almost there, Seeker. Keep it up. Nice save. That snitch is so close to being... What a shot! We're halfway into a nail-bitingly tense match. The Seeker has the snitch! Quaffle is the chaser scores! That's a pass to a teammate. It goes gold! is loose. You like incredible stop. Who will be the first to find the snitch? Sika found it, but can she catch it? United Kingdom saves it. The chaser passes. And it soars through the gold! The United Kingdom win, living to fight another day. Can their willpower take them all the way to the top of the Quidditch world stage? Will you 
let Sweden take home the illustrious Quidditch World Cup. My readers hope you won't let it go without a fight. Players take to the skies, their brooms racing almost as fast as their hearts. The quarrel is past. There's a quaffle pass. United Kingdom steals possession. Sweden steals possession. United Kingdom steals possession. Ouch! A hit like that is bound to leave more than just physical scars. There's the shot. It misses the hoop. What a save! Nothing's getting past that keeper. Sweet. Incredible shot! Chaser passes. United Kingdom steals possession. That's a fumble! United Kingdom, and that's a goal! Is free. That's a fumble. There's the snitch, but who will be the first to catch it? We have a player down. The quarrel is, and she scores. Seeker is halfway to catch the snitch. There's a quaffle pass. Oh dear, you hate to see that happen. She passes to her teammate. Sweden steals possession. The quaffle is passed. Sweden takes the shot. There's the shot. Nice save. With eyes set aflame with passion, the seeker reaches out and grabs the snitch. The quaffle is shot. Nice save. United Kingdom steals possession. Somebody, the chaser scores a goal. United Kingdom steals possession. United and it's in! 
That's a knockout by the beater. The quaffle and the quaffle is in. goes the snitch. United Kingdom takes the shot. The snitch is revealed. The chaser passes. The chaser passes. is not loose. The quaffle is loose. He goes for the water shot. The United Kingdom win, living to fight another day. Can their willpower take them all the way to the top of the Quidditch world stage? This has been your commentator, the esteemed source for all the hottest news, gossip, and Quidditch. Farewell. And with that victory, the United Kingdom have won the coveted Quidditch World Cup.